And so in the South, we have to learn to mask our progressive ideas in other things. Now, don't talk about getting rid of fossil fuels, but if you can talk about how to save us some money on our electricity, we'll talk to you about that. So it's, it's, it's not lying. It's simply re-wording uh, the truth so that the truth becomes more palatable to people who are not bright enough to understand the real truth. You know, there's nothing worse crazier in North Carolina politics than to be a left-wing liberal. And so that's, that's the kiss of death here for a politician. And so when, when Cal gets to Washington, uh, we're going to be able to lean in on Cal. He's going to vote right on 90 plus percent of the things that we think are important. So, I mean, you know, he just can't say all of that now. Oh, that's, why, that's why I'm voting for Cal Cunningham. That is why I'm voting for Cal Cunningham. Yeah, yeah. I just, Plain and simple. It, it, it hurts a little bit seeing him not support those yeah. policies. There could be pictures of Tim, Cal oh, Cunningham screwing oh, him. Okay. I think Cal Cunningham, like any Southern Democrat, mm -hmm. uh, is more liberal than he can say. Um, so for Cal Cunningham to win in North Carolina, he still has to be able to win some rural voters. Yeah. So he still has to say some things that they want to hear. Um, he's not going to vote for a Green New Deal uh, because that would be political suicide in North Carolina. But he will vote for Joe Biden's, um, yeah. you know, help, uh, environmental policies. I get it. So maybe he is more progressive. He just can't. He just can't actively say it. That's what I mean. Is like. Like, he looks like the perfect little good old boy. That's the shtick here, is the good old boy from, you know, small town North Carolina. I understand your problems, small town North Carolina, but I'm going to go to the big city and be a politician. You know, that's their thing. And so he was saying all that. Meanwhile, he's having an affair with a 20-something like, yeah. in his wife's bed. So Ooh. that's what I mean.